Welcome guys. We're going to be making some uh, cologne today. Now I don't only do gaming videos. I'm also hilarious. But I also, I've had this cologne obsession for years. So I feel like bringing you guys in on it. I mean, it's, it's so much fun. I love it. Um, I don't want to move the camera. It's, so I've got these specially marked bottles. Now these, I have one, two, three, four, five, six colognes so far that I've made um, out of numerous essential oils. You may be able to see some right there. But um, something that's really difficult, now I'll actually make a separate video how to make cologne um, using essential oils and establishing, establishing base notes, mid notes, and those top notes, very essential using essential oil. So another key issue to making cologne or perfume is color. See, now this is an example of what I feel is a botched coloring to a cologne perfume. I mean, it's way too bright. Um, it almost looks like juice or a cleaner. Now this was something else I had made. Um, it's so subtle that only in a certain light you may be able to see it, but it's a light blue. It is, I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. Or beautiful, however you uh, roll. But uh, yeah, this is, I mean, this is great. I love this color. Um, now next, I guess what I'll be doing is making a um, bright, almost a yellow. This is too neon. Yeah, a, a yellow, like a light yellow. Um, not, not so far as to where it looks like Mountain Dew or piss. But um, just to where it looks almost like a sunflower, early sunflower. Um, yeah, so let me dive in here. Let me get a bottle real quick. And I'll be right back. Alright, guys, I, I have an empty bottle here. Very empty. Um, well, it has water, that aside. But it's completely clear. Um, just tap water. And this is just so you're not wasting your essential oil. So... If you need to perfect a color, just do it on water. Um, I mean, it seems pretty obvious, but some people don't do obvious things. So what I use, I, I you can use a paper clip, you can use a um, bobby pin, safety pin, whatever. So what this does, because if you put one single drop, get this. This is one single drop. Okay, this is maybe uh, a tenth of a drop, but to get that, you really have to be careful here. You gotta. Oh, I just squeezed it all over the place. Okay, uh, guys, you got to be really careful. There, uh, I think what happened there was a, there was a little residual and it created a bubble. Well, let's come, come in here. So, you see, we're already starting to get, honestly, maybe as much yellow as we need. Let me see if this is a little better. All right, so we're starting to get starting to get a little yellow here. Let me give that a shake real quick. All right. Yeah, so we're getting a little bit of a yellow tint here. You might not be able to see it. Sorry, my phone's going off. I gotta learn it. So, you kind of see it? No? Well, it's getting there. Shoot, I am just launching everything. I'm getting so dirty. It's it was all fine before this video. So I'm going to dip this again into here and collect a little bit. And there we go. That's like a whole nother shade right there. Hopefully not too much. It's starting to look nice. We'll let that do its thing. There. I mean, it looks pretty nice. It's, it's a good way to distribute it. Um... Yeah, so I mean that's a nice yellow. It it may be a too it may be too dark, um, but again I <sighs> this thing got a little bit of traction uh, last time. I mean I tried my darndest to get this one all beautiful and look how it turned out. So yeah, here's here's the blue versus the yellow. Blue yellow. Actually, I'm really liking this yellow now that I look at it. Hmm. So yeah, guys, that is that is a, our finished color colognes. 
These are very light tones. That's just a preference of mine. Doesn't need to be a preference of yours. But these are probably my two favorite colors. Um, this one kind of suggests a little marine. This kind of suggests a little floral. You can do purple. You can do... Um, I've got all these different colors. So I'll probably make a few other videos. But this is my cologne coloring line. Okay, looks pretty good. So yeah, I, um, I'll probably be making another video on how to actually make cologne using essential oils, which I will coin Joe Rolone. Joe Ro Cologne, Joe Ro Gaming, you got it? I know you do. Nailed it.